Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Full Craft 2. I am your host, Renovate, as always. And uh, today, guys, we're going to be recording on the Voxel Squad server, uh, sponsored by Sticky Pistons. I almost forgot. It's been so long. Actually, it's been like five minutes since I recorded the last episode. We're going to do a big old a big old marathon today. We're just going to record all day long. So yeah, guys, today we are going to play with some cows. I know we did some cows earlier in the season, but I need to get something set up so I can just not worry about it anymore. So that's what we're going to do. So let's get started. All right, let's get my camera changed. All right, so our Woot Farm's working fantastic. I didn't make any upgrades yet. That's because I just got done recording. So uh, if you've leaving any comments on that previous episode and I didn't answer, that's because I'm just, uh, I'm still recording. So uh, I just got done making a bunch of mechanical users, a bunch of fluid tanks, a bunch of basic item filters, and now I need to make a crap ton of buckets. So let's go in here and let's grab some of our iron and let's just make uh let's make 14 that's all that's all the filters i have i don't know how many cows that we're gonna have so what the frick there we go all right this is our room okay i don't know if i showed this i think i did maybe i didn't so this used to be the room that all the chickens were in uh we had the chickens like sitting over here in the corner and uh we had all the chickens lined up in the center of the room and I, I've moved all the chickens downstairs and we turned this into our milking factory. Um, yes, that is a death. So let's get rid of that. Uh, let's go in here and let's get death and remove it. All right. Okay, so it's gone. Um, so yeah, this is our milking factory. And the way I have it set up is I set all these, um, these things. Where are they at? There it is. I set all these things underneath the center here. And so that it would still emit light and we're going to put glass pan or actually we're going to put the milking thing here and put glass panels around all the cows. They are going to get milked. And then on top of each one of these casting basins is going to be the fluid tank. And then the fluid tank is going to, if you remember back a couple episodes, we were making steel. The fluid tanks are going to empty into a cast, an ingot cast. And then that ingot cast is going to go back into our uh, ME system. So that is what we're going to do. Now, before we do that, though, I forgot to do something. So I'm going to do it really quick. And with the power of editing, it's going to look like it just split second happened. Watch this. Boom. All right. So I lied about the power of editing. <laughs> I just wanted to show you guys what I was going to do. Um, I'm changing all the bottom of these blocks to the factory blocks, which is a pretty easy recipe. It's just stone and iron. And uh, you can make these. Uh, this is what I used on my ceiling downstairs and I wanted to make it look like all these things were being held up by metal stilts. So that's what I'm doing. I just thought maybe you guys might want to see it. I haven't really done a lot of... Where did I use all six? Oh, there they are. I hate that glitch. I really do. Um, I haven't done much building with you guys in this series at all so I just wanted to show you what I've been doing. All right, so there's that. So now they look like they're all up in stilts. I might change these blocks out to the other factory block that looks like um, that looks like it's metal, like these, but I don't know. That's kind of, uh, I don't know. We'll see. I don't know if we need any of these like f funny, cool blocks like that. All right, so what we're gonna do now, before we get uh, set up, is we gotta put these mechanical users in there. And these things are kind of finicky, so we need to um, go like this, if it's going to let us. Let's go. I need to do like two buttons at the same time to get this to work. There we go. All right. So these all need to face up because that's what direction, oh crap, they are going to be working just like we did our cows downstairs. Same concept. I'm not paying attention to my, let's go up there. It's hard when you're flying because you can't, it's hard to like shift click and hold still and there, do that. Let's just hold those two buttons the whole time we're flying. This is going to make it a lot easier like that. And I might have more cows. I might have uh, more of these than we actually need, but I just want to get it set up in case, in case we do need 
uh, that many. So let's go ahead and let's set this like this. And do we have some more glass? I need to chisel some more glass. Let's chisel some more glass to the stone frame. That's what I've been using. I just like the look of it. Looks kind of nice. And we're going to do this because we're going to go downstairs and get cows as we go along. Okay. So then we need to. How are we going to do that? We actually know we actually need to knock out all these blocks because I need to get an X. I need to get access into the corner there while we're doing all this. And we need to change all this to um, entity and then right click random slot. We'll just use them all on upper left hand. So we'll go ahead and do that. Make sure you do this. If you guys are following along, make sure it's on entity and then you can put it in the upper right left hand slot, which is that one. It doesn't I, honestly, I don't, I've done it before. I don't think it really matters what slot it goes into, but maybe it does. I don't know. Um, if you just left click, it'll actually go backwards. There you go. Let's do that and then click on that like that. So we'll do that to all of these like that. I love the sound that that makes. I, I miss that sound. <laughs> Um, upper left hand entity, uh, entity, upper left hand, repetitive work, the things you got to do to do Minecraft. All right. So we do that. Okay. So that's all done. All right. So the next thing we need to do is make a bunch of ingot casts. So let's, how many do we have? We have one, two, three, four, five. So we only have 10, 10 machines. So we need to go upstairs. And I don't know if I have that much gold, to be honest with you. I mean, we do have gold. I just don't know. Oh, I have blocks of gold. Never mind. And then we need our ingot cast. So we're going to need that. Actually, we just need an ingot. So let's grab an ingot. I don't know if the ingot gets used. Um, that's a good question. We'll find out. So let's look in here. How much gold do we have? Hello. Uh, gold one block. So that's a nine and four ingots. So we got plenty enough. All right, let's see. I don't remember if the if the ingot gets consumed or not. Let's do this and this, and we'll make ten of these. Actually, let's make nine because I already have one. Yes, it does. Okay, and you know what? They're not going to stack. I knew it. Um, let's put this. Um, we need the buckets. So I went ahead and set up this whole entire line right here. Um, you can see I got all of the um, all the collars done. Basically, I'm pulling in and pulling out. And if you uh, if you didn't watch any of the previous episodes, I'll do this last one on camera. So what we want to do is we want to we want to do insert or insert and outsert. So we want to insert. I'm going to set the insert to red, and we're going to extract on green. And we're going to set this to always active. Now what we want to do is put a filter in here, and set it to blacklist uh, blacklist a empty bucket. And I'll explain in just one second y and then we're going to set this one to the same thing so we're going to set this to the opposite so it's going to insert on green and extract on red always active okay and then we're going to put buckets in every one of these put them up here on the top so we go back and do all this and then we can close up that block and make it look all nice and then we can put our cows in there okay so the reason that we want to blacklist an empty bucket on the extract if the cows uh have been milked okay the bucket is going to sit in here and basically what the mechanical user is doing is it's milking the cow. It's sending the bucket over here. I know for some of you, you're like, you've already explained that. Well, some of you haven't seen that episode. So, um, but basically what it does, we don't want it to extract an empty bucket because if it does, it's just going to be repeating itself all the time. And we don't want an empty bucket getting thrown into this. Uh oh. All right, we're back. Uh, so what's going on is uh, link to killer has something in his inventory that's uh, causing the server to crash and we haven't figured out what it is and we're waiting for an admin to fix it or at least delete his player file so we can get uh, so he can get back on and play because everybody wants to play. Um, so what I was saying is we don't want to keep extracting empty buckets all the time. We only, only want it to extract a bucket that's full and so that's why we do that. So that's why the filters on there. All right, so let's put all these buckets in here. We almost have this thing ready to go, 
And the only thing that we are missing is our blocks. So let's grab all our blocks, fill all these back in, because I don't want to, oops, I don't want to, crap, I don't want to see all the wires and things. Like so. And then the next thing we're going to do is we are going to set some cables down here. And then we don't have enough cables. <laughs> Kidding me. I should have been more prepared. Doo -doo 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 -doo. I bet we don't even have pulsating iron. Let's check. I bet we don't even have binder conduit. Let's go to Ender IO. I should know the recipe already. Um, I do know the recipe, but I just don't feel like typing it in because I'm lazy. Let's get this. Let's see if we can make. How many can we make? 40. That's more than enough. <laughs> let's go back upstairs. Oh, missed the floor. All right, so let's do that. That one shouldn't have went that way. Boop. All right. And we got one weird one here. And then we are just going to make this. This is going to be ugly for now, but that's okay. I'm going to dress this up with some little Ender IO stuff going on. We are going to put this like that. I'm going to insert here and insert here. The problem with the Ender IO cables is the extract's always set to. What? Wait, wait, wait. The extract is always set to uh, never. So. And that's annoying. <laughs> so we're going to always extract this. Let's do that. And so what this is going to do is it's going to put the fluid into the cast. Wait, 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 wait. What am I doing? Always active. Okay, I'm doing this right. It's going to set the fluid into the cast. The cast is going to make ingots. The ingots are going to get pulled out of here into our inner chest. In this inner chest, hopefully nobody's... Oh, I forgot a diamond. The inner chest is going to uh, put it back in our system. Can I not go down any further? What the frick? Let's grab a diamond like that. And then you know what we should probably uh, uh, go ahead and do is... Let's grab... Uh, let's see, net. Let's grab our nets. Do we have, how many we have, 11? That's good. We only need 10, because we only have 10 things available. Um, let's go down here and mark this with a diamond. Like that. All right, so let's go downstairs and pick what cows we want. Let's just make sure we have all our glass and stuff ready, because once we put the cows in here, we got to glass them up. All right, there we go. So actually, we need to go upstairs. Okay, so I want to get the basic... Uh, ingots first so let's put all this up there I'm gonna put all this up here and that will give us space for our cows down here so let's see do let's start over here do we want a vibrant alloy uh, yes because that's ender IO so let's get that one do we want resonant ender nope do we want biofuel no a tin one uh, we'll think about that one. Uh, let's see, obsidian, no. Solarium, that might be a good one to have. Um, let's come back to that one. Okay. Electrum, no, not that important. Uh, vapor, no. Energetic alloy, that would be a good one. Uh, XP mini moon, no. Energized glowstone, no. Blood mini moon, uh, mini moon. Blazing pyrithium, no. Solarium, another solarium. Dark steel, we do want that one. Uh, another Solarium, Electrical Steel, let's take him, uh, Signalum, um, why not, okay, uh, Blazing, nope, and then do we get, what's this little guy back here, Elementium, this would be the Ender IO ones, I would like to do the Ender IO ones, how many do we have left, we have one, two, three, four, five, so we can get five more cows, let's see what we have over here first, uh, Pulsating Iron, we do want that one, we got two of those, and then uh, infinity, no, no. What's the steel? Let's go get the steel. Sunshine, Electrium, and Zebra. I thought I had 
like an, an there's an invar one we have to, might have to make a couple more things so that's one two three four five six seven eight we can get two more cows let's go ahead and get um zinc elementium you know what let's go ahead and get the two um I'll go ahead and make another cow stand. Let's go ahead and get the two indire oak cows. Where's the other one at? It's like a green cow, isn't it? Yeah, it's right here, probably. Nope. Uh, is it you? Man of steel. I'm looking for the terra steel one, actually. Is it this guy over here? Uh, isn't that what we just got? Elementium? Elementium. So we have elementium. Huh. What are you? No. Nope. I'm looking for, this is the Terra Steel. I thought I had a blue one that was the uh, Mana Steel. Is this you right here? That's Vapor of Lividity. This is the Mana Steel. So maybe it's a green cow? Is it? Huh. I must have lost him. Unless this is him here. Nope. I must not have that cow. Okay, whatever. We'll, we'll deal with it later. All right, so let's go downstairs. Whoops. The joy of flying. And let's start throwing you guys in here. So we have Elementium. Let's put you in there. And let's get our glass. Boop. All right. And then our next cow will be uh, Man of Steel. Boop. And then our next cow will be uh, Dark Steel. And then uh, electrical steel. So all the steels go in on this side. That's funny. And then we're going to have um, pulsating iron. Let's do steel. Might as well keep with the flow here. And then let's go uh, signalum. That's fine. I don't know why we really need signalum. Let's do pulsating iron here. Uh, is that all of them on this row? Uh, Invar. Let's do you. And then, is that all of them on this row? Yep, okay, so let's, boop. So then we have these two guys. Now I have two in my bag too, so I wanna see what those are. Um, I have a Essence Mini Moo, a Demon Moo, and a Demon Metal Mini Moo. Uh, we'll deal with that. So what else we have? We have Vibrant Alloy, that's a, that's a must. And then uh, Energetic Alloy. So I think that's all the Ender IO Alloy ones. So these are going to create ingot casts, and they are all going to go into this chest. And you can actually see that that one already formed an ingot. And if we go downstairs, let's check something. And there's so many that are named steel. Let's go down here. Let's go in here and let's type in steel. And you can see we're getting electrical steel, mana steel, and steel. Let's see if any of these numbers go up. There's six. The only thing I'm not seeing is the... Uh, it says 24, 6, and 6. Let's see if we're getting any more. 24, 6, and 6. Um, I know that I don't have any elementiums, so let's try elementium. So I have seven elementium. Uh, and then we have, so the, so the Elementium just went up to eight. So it is working. All right. Awesome. That is freaking awesome. So that is automation of the mini moves. That's cool. I like this. So for whatever reason, that molten energetic alloy, he doesn't give, uh, as much. I wonder why he didn't give that much. See, this one's stuck too. So... He must have already been milked, maybe. Yeah, I'll just have to keep an eye on this, because these are filling up. Who are you? Dark Steel Mini Moo. How'd you freaking get out? What the frick? Oh, I didn't put in glass. <laughs> All right. Sorry about that. Let's get our glass out. Let's put... Uh... I guess that would help. Boop. Sorry, man. All right, so those guys are getting done. Uh, this still doesn't show. Oh, there it goes. Okay, so it is working. Okay. It's just one bucket must not be 
They must not milk a whole bucket. I don't know. I don't know how this works, but it is working regardless. And like always, I'm going to take a nice little screenshot. Actually, you know what? I'm going to do it like. I'm going to do it like this. Boop. And like that. All right. Screenshot. All right. Cool, guys. This has been uh, another episode of Fullcraft 2 uh, Mini Moo autom uh, Automation. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you learned something. Uh, if you got any comments or suggestions, please leave them down below. Also, check out all the other people that's playing on the Voxel Squad server. And uh, make sure you uh, hit that like button, please. And make sure you hit that subscribe button, please. Uh, help me grow my channel. I'm getting real close to 200, which is pretty exciting for me. This is my second go round. And uh, so I'll see you next episode, guys. I don't know what we're going to work on, but I think I have in mind to do uh, maybe the end uh, with whoever else wants to do it. And then also I want to start getting into, I think it's Astral or Astral something, uh, but it's where you can uh, play with the stars. So I'll see you next episode, guys. It's been fun.